What up, everyone? Uh, we got an unboxing today, starring my buddy Will. Sup? This is a bunch of, sh like, well, shit that <laughs> I found him. So, hope you enjoy. I'm pretty sure it's gonna suck, though. You never know. Okay, so let's begin. Should, should I? I yeah, go ahead. First thing first, that's, you know, chips. <laughs> I kind of go without saying. Smoky bacon. Apparently they're good. They are. Here in Quebec City, smoky bacon ain't that... The smoky bacon chips ain't that great, so... These ones are pretty damn good. Yeah. God damn it, my pale. I'm dying. Dude. Look at this. <laughs> okay. And then, you know, for some reason, all the chicken chips were away, so I just grab what I could find. <laughs> Tato? Tato brand. They're British, apparently. But, um, they're good. All of a sudden, for some reason, I can't find the the chicken chips anymore. Could find them everywhere. Now, all of a sudden, well, it's been a pleasure, dude. Honestly, <laughs> hey, <laughs> there's more. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, there's like four. Oh, I, 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 I get it. Tato, potato. Yeah. Potato. <laughs> That's a different brand. I've sent you those ones before. Dude, that's... They could get sued for that. Mm. It's legit the Lay's fucking logo. It is. I, I kind of get the feeling that Walker's might own Lay's. Or vice versa. No, because you'd see fr uh, Lay. Frito-Lay, yeah, it could be. Um, <laughs> they, they should be sued. I guess probably because... If know, nobody does it, I'm going to do it. <laughs> I guess because officially, you know, they're imported from Britain, right? So, I guess. So, there you go. Shit ton of chips. Good shit. I have a heart attack and a few. Yep. Okay, so that's a DVD, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, that's that. Wait, oh, one. Ratatouille. I know about that. Yeah. That is a copy of Starship Troopers 2. New about that. Oh, yeah. The Violence Movie. You're in for a blast with that one. Never heard about this shit. Just, just turn it back to the front for a second. Okay, and and, 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 and re remember, and uh, look at that. These are by uh, Harry Manfredini and a uh, part five poster mask, I guess. Pretty much, um, it was shot on video back in the eighties by some guys who you know were just like messing Friday around. Friday fans? Not, I don't think they were. E I assume they were Friday fans at some point. But you know, it, it it's bad. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, look at that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not great, but essentially they ended up <laughs> going on to do some decent stuff. So. Oh, okay. It's two movies. Yeah, yeah. When they put this out, uh, you know, they were like, we'll call up ha Harry Manfredini, you know, and, and get the actual. It is the fucking Friday phone, too. It is. <laughs> <laughs> It's a classic. It really is. It's it's like I said. It's not great, but what, it, it's a fun release. What year? Uh, like nineteen eighty. I want to say like four or something or eighty eight. And then additional footage in two thousand and three. Okay, so that's, <laughs> yeah. I would I would for a fucking blast, dude. Honestly, you, you are. You're you're gonna you're gonna dig that one. Honestly, just just. Take out the the violence movie mm -hmm. like uh, logo and replace it with Friday the Thirteenth Part Five at the beginning, and it would work. It would it totally <laughs> would. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Thank You're you. welcome, my dude. Oh, eight millimeters. Yeah. No, no, you have a bad. Our point. I think I heard armor. about this movie. It's awesome. It really is. No one talks about it anymore. This was like Korean horror from 2004, back before it got. Is it like the. Uh, 
Vietnam, yeah, kind of shit. Yeah, Vietnam War. South uh, base, serious radio. I didn't even know South Korea it, were poor in Vietnam. <laughs> you know, no, because they don't even mention Vietnam. But maybe I saw it. But uh, it's a good movie. You got that. Got to love Tartan, dude. Special features. Oh yeah, making of our point. I mean, that's nineteen seventy-two Vietnam. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I saw this movie, but it's been like. Forever. So. Oh yeah. Thanks a lot, dude. Hell's yeah. It's a it's a badass movie. Thanks a lot. Best movie there yet. And you know, like, uh, can never go wrong with Tartan. Yeah, absolutely. And you know, except for you know when they went out of business. <laughs> that kind of can be a bit so of a far downer. Kick ass fucking shit. That's a book. Yep. That's a hardcover. Yep. Am I supposed to? No, just uh, just open your eyes and take a look. No, no. Is, is it like the uh, there's one Batman shit mm-hmm. that's got? Yep. Is that? No, oh, yeah. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Wow, dude. Oh, yeah. Mint dude, I had it. my eyes on this shit, dude, for a while. So. <laughs> there you oh. go. <laughs> it's a good book. Never read it, though. It's good. What's what's the, the story, though? I don't know. So. It's been years since I read it, but essentially it's like um, Batman going after people who are, like, uh, abusing kids. I'm like, What's like, wrong with that? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Like, uh, molesting kids and, like, you know, uh, what's it called, uh, my, I have a brain fart. You know, where you take kids and, like, move them across borders and stuff? Oh, you meant trafficking? Human trafficking, yeah. Yeah. Oh. It's, it's a good book. Great, great, dude. You're gonna dig that. And that was back, you know, before there was, like, a gay Chinese Alfred. <laughs> And I love the, the fact the good old days. Yeah, I love the fact that the the author has an eye patch. He looks like <laughs> what's it? You know the, the dude uh, in the Dark Knight. Okay, the Dark yeah. Knight. You know the dude in the bank. The yeah, Joker's book. Yeah, <laughs> he looks like him. completely. He does. <laughs> it makes you wonder. Look at that. He looks just like this dude. <laughs> he, he looks like him he does it makes you wonder whether they didn't cast him well they did uh, they did in the, the, the Dark Knight but yeah, no know, no I mean like him maybe they cast him in that role oh yeah it's possible dude he looks just like him dude. he does <laughs> don't ask me why that's shiny I don't know oh it's like waxed is that, is that I, I guess, yeah. Awesome, dude. Awesome. It's a kick-ass book. Awesome. Oh, uh, you know what, dude? Yeah. Give me, give me stuff. Okay, okay, that'll work. Okay. You ready? Uh, just a sec. Uh, where did my fucking vape? Uh, it's hey. over here. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Okay. Okay, that's a book. Yep. That's a small book. Yes, it is. It's probably big. Nope. Is it DC? No, no. Is it it Marvel? No. Is it horror? Ah, yeah. No idea what it is. Scanners? Yep, novelization of scanners. There's a novelization? Apparently. I had it in my collection, so there you go. I, I, never, <laughs> I love this movie so much, I but know. I never knew there was. I know, I know you dig Scanners more than I do. You know, I like Scanners and all, but you know, so I thought, you know what? 
Uh, who? You'll appreciate that who one. Who wrote it, though? Some dude. Uh, Leon Whiteson. He'd be cancelled nowadays. Because he's white and a son. Yep, white privilege. Yep, they don't take kindly of that. They mm. blow up your head. I don't know. Maybe you shouldn't uh, upload this video. Maybe. Oh, well. <laughs> no one watching my channel cares about that. <laughs> Sweet, I'm gonna read that for sure, dude. Oh yeah, goddamn dude. Old books. They they have a, a scent. Ah, uh, beautiful. Oh yeah. Okay, next. Okay, that's definitely a DVD. Mm -hmm. I can't guess what it is, but give me some clues. Though. Um, it's an Asian flick. Is it a movie that I know of? You might. I don't know. It's it's very under the radar. No one really talks about it. I probably don't know it. Then you probably don't know it. St. John's Words. Yep. Never heard about it. So. It's it's a pretty decent little flick, honestly. Um, You know, it is what it is. I'll just say that. And that is the Universe Laser Region 3 DVD. Oh, so the, the cover are longer? Like, like longer. the uh, yeah. audition? Like that yeah. shit fucking bothers me, dude. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it bothers me, too. Sweet. Never heard about it, so. It's it's a good little flick, you know. Um, you can't go wrong with it, you know, like creepy Asian horror. It's always a good thing. This article contains material may, which may have fed and may not be distributed. It may not be distributed. I don't know. Circulated, <laughs> sold, or hired. That that's kind of weird. Yeah, a universe laser always put that weird stuff on. I don't know. This why. article contains material which may offend and may not be dis distributed, circulated, sold, hired. I know. Keep going. Like uh, hi, hi, given, land, shown, played, or projected to a person under the age of 18 years. Yeah, but this article contains material which may offend, may not be distributed, circulated, or sold, but it is. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but you're not under 18, so. Yeah. yeah. Cool. cool. <laughs> Gotta give that a shot. <laughs> Weird ass fucking advertising, dude. Definitely. Oh shit, dude! That's the fucking thing you, you told me about. Oh yeah. Okay, so that is essentially the X Files before the X Files existed. Kolchak Night Stalker. That was a TV show that was like late seventies, uh, maybe like around mid seventies. I think. I think so. It was like seventy seven, seventy eight, something like that. And. Uh, Honestly, uh, Glenn told me about this shit, like, a bunch, and I never got around to check it out or pick it up, honestly. I never, like, come across, mm -hmm. like, uh, this series on DVD or anything, so. Kolchak and Night Stalker, the uniquely eerie mystery series that uh, paved the way for the X-Files. Comes to DVD with all 20 original one-hour episodes of the 1974-75. Yeah. A series primetime Emmy nominee Darren McGavin stars as Carl Kolchak, uh, a headstrong investigative reporter on the trail of the paranormal, zombies, vampires, werewolves, ghosts, succubi, 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 succubi. Okay, <laughs> uh, succubi, and even aliens. No matter how unnatural or unbelievable, Kolchak is there to uncover the truth. One supernatural threat at a time. Join the hunt. In the dark alleys and creepy hidden layers of Chicago, with such sensational guest stars as Catman, Crothers, Antonio Fargus, Sharon Farrell, Dick Van Patten, Jamie Farr, Larry, Linville, Jim Bakis, and more. This fucking shit looks fucking creepy, dude. It is. It's it's so it's such a good show that honestly got you know it had its initial run. It had a bit of a you know, they, they, they did two movies, and there was a bit of a, like, a throwback revival series, but that didn't do very well. Was it ever, like, re-released on Blu-ray, or? Uh, it's coming out from Kino later this month. Oh! Yeah. 
So, you know, it's a, it's a definite, you know. Uh, I'm going to check it out for sure. Hell, dude. 20 hours worth of Carl Kolchak. Thanks a lot, my dude. That's the shit. Definitely going to check this out. <laughs> okay, next one. You, you know about this one. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Finding Nemo. Gotta love Finding Nemo. Because, you know, everything says horror like Finding Nemo. Mm, absolutely. Okay, here's the next one. So, and it's fucking sealed. Oh, yeah. Again, Titan, Tartan, you can't go wrong with Tartan. Uh, this one, though, I never heard about. Is is good. And I mean, honestly, that cover alone, that's just kind of creepy. Oh, it's a side slip. Yep. Cool. Okay, so, looking for, uh, so this movie is Sorum, uh, what year? Uh, I think early 2000s. 2001. It's yeah. uh, so right really early 2000s. So looking for a fresh start, a young taxi driver moves into apartment uh, number 504, but crumbling tenement. He soon discovers the previous tenant died mysteriously, and everyone on the floor is somehow connected to the dead man. After befriending the troubled neighbor living a few doors down, he stumbles into an affair that sends them both down a dark path. But there's something else odd about the atmosphere in the rundown building. Does a ghost haunt those living here? Or does true evil exist in those left alone? <laughs> it's it's fun. I it, love the cover though. I know, that's just really kinda creepy. Yeah. Something about babies and blood just don't go together, I, I always want to think. Well, well, I'm going to just ask you one thing. Asia mm. Extreme. Yeah. Every fucking Tartan, like, title, well, not every, because I own uh, Man Bites Dog. Yeah. But most of, um, you know, Asian or Japanese or Chinese flicks, mm -hmm. they all have Asia extreme, but some yeah. some of them aren't that aren't. extreme. Yeah, <laughs> es essentially, it's you know like how um, you know um, unearthed have like the two extreme for mainstream line. Yeah, yeah, it's just the same thing. Okay, so most of them sucks. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know it's like um. Really, it should have been like Tartan Asian collection, but I guess you know they wanted to make it sound a bit more better. Yeah. Somehow, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next up. It has two books. It's one, two, three, four. Okay, that's four books. Mm -hmm. No fucking idea what this is. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs> That's beautiful, dude. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so. So. Look. That. <laughs> ah, man. <laughs> dude, that, that, that's fucking cool, dude. They're pretty cool little, you know, I don't. I, don't ask me about Bionicle. I don't know. <laughs> Bionicle, it was I pretty, Bionicle was pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You know, it was just when they tried to reboot. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's a shame it didn't you last. Know, really. just, you, know. you know, they, they tried to, uh, you know, um, I guess, like, get people interested again. Yeah. Honestly, I think it would have worked better if they just re repressed... I guess you can say repressed. Yeah, there's some biology for you. With an axe. No, no. Or something. You got like a bionicle comic at the end. That's pretty fucking cool. 
Oh man. It, I'm a '90s baby, so binacle were the shit for me. So there I'm glad go. I got some binacles as a bonus <laughs> in there. Thanks a lot, bro. That's that's fucking amazing. Hell yeah, man. That's amazing. Uh, is there more in this? Uh... There might be. I mean, I know they. Uh, I know they did a uh, like a run kind of where they had like a bunch of new stories, like maybe one old story, mm-hmm. like in like a full you know size thing. I don't know how long it lasted. <clears throat> Honestly, I just wish they'd kind of just reissued the old ones, but that's just me. Beautiful. Hells yeah. <laughs> okay, next thing. Oh yeah, that's another book I can't. Oh yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> if you know me, you know I'm a huge, huge horror video video game fan. <laughs> Dead Island is probably one of my favorite. Um, with Dead Space, Silent Hill, and shit like that. And you told me that there were some novels too. Oh yeah. And that motherfucker got me a fucking Dead Island <laughs> novel. So. Yeah, I I was try, trying to find you one of the Dead Space ones, but they're kind of hard to come by. At uh, least the first one is. When does this... That's the story of the first game. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So it's, you know, told from, like, if I remember right, from, like, multiple perspectives and stuff, so... Dude, I, I'm gonna have to call to, to call off, dude. For like, I'm gonna like call in sick for like sixteen days, dude. <laughs> just, just to read all the shit I got. Yeah. Read and fucking watch. Oh yeah. Okay. Beautiful. Thanks a lot, dude. You're welcome, man. Now the next thing is what I was telling you actually has a bit of value to it. Uh, should I? Oh, that's a vinyl. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's definitely a vinyl. Can, can, before I look, can you mm-hmm. give me some clues? Maybe? Okay. Uh, I'm trying to think of something that won't give it away. Um, Finland. Okay. Uh, Black metal? Yep. Not Gold Moon. I'm not saying. You're going to have to open your eyes and see. Check the other side. Well, I already I can already tell it's fucking Gold Moon. Oh, yeah. Dude. But check the It's here. fucking Gold Moon. Hell yeah. That's the one, man. Found it the other day. And I was like, damn. I don't own this one, dude. Check, check the vinyl. Ah, oh, shit. Ah. <laughs> oh. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> and we're no Nazis, by the way. Hell no, but, you know, good music is good, good music. Good music is good music. I don't give a flying fuck if you're offended by the fact that I listen to fucking Goat Moon. I couldn't care less. Exactly. You know, when you start limiting yourself in what you listen to because of someone's political idea ideology you um you're not doing yourselves any favors absolutely and i mean um you know <clears throat> when i listen to music you know i don't really listen to music for like the message that comes with it it's no. like what my ears my my ears like fucking like uh capture if you will yeah. that's what my my if I like it, you know, it goes through my fucking ear, my little small ass brain, <laughs> process it, and it's just, it's good music. If it's good music, I can't, it would be super duper fucking poser for me to say, no, I don't like it, it's an SBM, no. Yeah. It's the most poser shit you can do. It's good black fucking metal, so good ass fucking black metal. Oh, yeah. Wow, thanks a lot, dude. 
Yeah. I, I saw that and I was like, I had, I had to get it for you. In the wild or? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So now they're selling that in the wild. Well, I don't think they knew what they had. Considering they, <laughs> considering <laughs> they had it under H. H? H. H. So, hold. Mm. I don't know. I don't think they even knew what the name was. I was like, oh. Mm. H. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks a lot, dude. Uh, yeah, next up. Should I close my eyes? Or? Yeah. Yeah. That's a shirt. Yes, it is. It's a Black Lives Matter shirt. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't. I can't fucking. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I had to get it. I saw it. And I was like, you know what, dude? Yeah. You know what? You wanna you wanna know a funny story? Yeah. I had the exact same shirt, but it was, like, bigger mm -hmm. when I was young. And we were, like, maybe I was, like, uh, I don't know, I'm 25, so let's say I was, like, maybe 17, mm -hmm. some shit. I had the exact same fucking design on a shirt. And we were, like, camping, me and my buddies, we were, we were camping, and... It was getting cold and shit like that. We were fucking like obliterated. Obliterated. <laughs> and uh, the fire was fucking dying. So uh, I ended up taking Ooh. off my shirt and uh, fucking like starting up the, the fucking fire with it. But it worked. Well, yeah. Well, you're still alive. So. <laughs> and now you've got a replacement. <laughs> so like <laughs> fucking 10 years later. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and thanks a lot, bro. Hell yeah, man. Okay. Next one. Eyes closed or? Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, another shirt for sure. Oh, yeah. Can you give me like a... Uh... It's comic related. Where's the fucking neck? Uh, there. <laughs> okay. Okay, so comic related. Uh, Marvel or DC? That would give it away. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, hero or villain? Hero. Um. Okay, hero. Uh. Is he part of the Justice League? No. Is he part of the Avengers? No. Is he part of, uh, like, Red Hood teams? No. Is he part of the Marvel Knights? I don't know. The Marvel Knights is like Ghost Rider, Punisher, uh, Electro, Daredevil. Yes. So it's a Punisher. Oh, sure. yeah. I already own this one. Well, you got another one now. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what, dude? Because let, let me show the... Dude. You see how oh, fucking yeah. studded my shit is? Yeah. Mine has got, like, fucking, like, multiple fucking hole through it. <laughs> so, I'm gonna take it. Hell it's yeah. more hey, than welcome. <laughs> it's more than welcome, dude. <laughs> okay. Last couple of things here. Well, that's one, well, you know, it's, you don't need to close your eyes with that one, it's just the cover of a blood beach. Oh, uh, well, yeah, yeah. I, need, I need that, absolutely. And last up, this is something I found, it was, it was, it was cheap, but it's kind of awesome. You may already have one, I don't know, but, there you go. Uh, no, I don't have that. Well, you got it now. <laughs> what is it? Just open it up, take a look. Oh, yeah. So, Star Wars Episode 1. We got young ass fucking Skywalker running. Yep. You know, before he genocided people.
favorite Star Wars character. Right? Hell yeah. No, I mean there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not so much, but you know. That's an old fucking book, right? Oh hell yeah! That that came. I think from what I know, this was uh, from the original theatrical release. It was like given out, uh, kind of like as a, like a promo, I guess. Darth Jar Jar, best Star Wars character right there. Let me tell you that. <laughs> That's a, that's, that's, that's a, I mean, it's got some nice artwork and everything, you know, it's like, dude. you know, it's definitely something a bit unique. I'd never seen one before. I was like, wow, look at that. See, those are the eyes of a Sith Lord. Oh, absolutely, dude. You mean? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that's oh, that's beautiful, dude. <laughs> Do you think this Vader is CG? Might be. You never know. It looks like it lo- lo- looks a little bit. Actually, looks kind of like a a humidifier, and I would know. Oh, absolutely! <laughs> oh, beautiful, beautiful, dude. Hell's yeah, man. But you know what? Since we're filming, I'm gonna give you one more thing. Okay, cool. So let me put that in the trash. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, right there. Well, I got two. Uh, which one? Uh, which one do you want first? The the movie one or the like the music? One? Uh, music. Oh, dude! David Bowie, man! Extended cut of Let's Dance. Oh, that's awesome! You gotta love Bowie. Yeah, Honestly, true. like if you say you don't like Bowie, you're lying. Yeah, fuck him. Yeah. Preferably with uh, some type of barbed wire bat. Mm. Awesome. (laughs) Sweet. Thanks, man. Awesome. Mm. That's damn cool. The next one is a record store day exclusive. Oh, okay. That should be interesting. You ready? Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at that right there. Oh, wow. That is badass. <laughs> that is gorgeous. It is. Thank you, my dude. <laughs> no problem. Thank you. Thanks, Steve. Hells yeah. Uh, another video though tomorrow because uh, I got plenty of shit to <laughs> to give to Glenn, but tomorrow just to to make the pleasure last. So oh yeah, <laughs> so yes, there we go. We are the fucking graveyard shit podcast. We are. See and we y'all kick ass. next fucking time. So yeah. <laughs>